Um, now getting her all of her clothes organized and folded. And I'm working all day, but I thought you guys might want to see a little bit of this. And the girls are at VBS again, and I'm gonna find some of these. Okay, so I got them all folded. Now, newborn, zero to three. Long sleeves, three months. And then the sleepers over here. Um, newborn, zero to three, zero to three. Sleepers, and then these are more like fitted ones. And then three to six over here. Got boobs over here. And these are all the swatter blankets we have there. Shirts here, hats, socks, and stuff I need to hang up over there. I just have to put them in the drawers. Okay, I got all her clothes organized now. So, drawers. They are? Yeah. So, this is the swaddle blankets. That's the Moby Wrap You're going to have to blankets. change all these labels? So, these are all the newborn stuff right here. Onesies and pants, sleepers. Not time stuff, and then this is zero to three, three month stuff. Then all the nursing stuffs in there, blankets down here. What's all in, of those. Uh, these drawers. That was um, the candy table covers. Yep. Blankets everywhere. That I mean, is huh? no. This one is sheets. That's sleepy things. These are sheets. Those are the whatever she sleeps with. Those things. <laughs> okay. And over here, it, this is even bigger stuff. This is like six months um, stuff and all of the, look at all those bibs. And then socks and all the bloomers, hats in there. And then her closet, like her closet and doors are a lot smaller than what Kinsley and Claire's were because I think we got rid of stuff. Then I organized them up there. You didn't have as much as you thought, did you? Yep. No, but that's okay. We don't need that much stuff. No, I know. I don't need so much stuff. But I do need the crib up higher again. Yeah, I gotta get the And pool. You gotta get this name down. So, I know. It's hard to take her Claire's name down because it's like stuck to the paint, I think. So, maybe Camry's gonna have Claire on her wall. <laughs> I don't know this lady, but I have to film her. It is so hilarious watching her work out. Check her out. I asked for permission. Do the other thing you were doing. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. I think we need to modify some of these. A month into it. She's doing great. I got a month to go. You're an inspiration. Right. And I would do this one, but it's hard to do this Don't one. do that one. We gotta no, keep like, it's just because my belly's in the way. It's not hard to do. Well, we want to keep that. Um, like this? It's hard to swing under my legs, but my, my belly's in the way. We got to keep that mucus plug in there, all right? There's not, if there's one thing I can't stand, it's this right here. here. It's people that park. Suck it in. <laughs> Suck it in. <laughs> Alright, I'll pull out, then you can get in. That's crazy. You park so close I cannot to you. stand that though. It's crazy. At the doctor's office, the lady did that. That's a big pet peeve of mine. And she sat right beside me inside too. Did you, did you give her an evil eye? No, she, and she parked like right after I did like this. Hey, bye. I just want to go see you.
What? 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 You're five. Did you have five? What? How old are you? I miss you today. She you're said five. five. You're, no, you're, you're not five. five. <laughs> Seven. 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 No. Oh, what's the night? What? Yeah. Oh, what's the night? What's the night? I don't. So, did y'all have fun? Oh, what did you make? Good. Did you make something, Kinsley? Yeah. A shield? So guys, I'm at work this morning and just wanted to give y'all a little update because yesterday morning, this is little TMI. And this is the first of the vlogs, this is crazy, but anyways, I wanna keep y'all updated. Hopefully y'all, you guys, will, I don't know if she's coming soon or not, but it's crazy. Well, I'm, only, I'm only 34 weeks, so I was like, I surely, I did not expect to have anything like this going on until later. And at my shower this weekend, we didn't get to do our pictures. We still have pictures in two weeks. So to already have some signs is like crazy. I don't know if we're even gonna get to our pictures because, yeah. And hopefully I'll make it till this weekend. So yesterday morning, I told you guys, I had like this brown discharge stuff. Sorry, I feel like I'm telling you guys way too much, but you guys are curious on that but so yeah and it was just yesterday morning so i wasn't too worried about it and it was just a little bit and then i just kept an eye on it and the rest of the day it was nothing no more of it so then this morning when i got up it did it again it was like a little reddishy though and that makes me more nervous i'm like why is it red like i don't mind the brownishy light like, light color but they're red that worries me more. So I called my doctor and told her it was like reddishy brown this time this morning. And it seemed like a little bit more. But they said to not be too worried that as long as I'm not hurting, I should be okay. And to keep an eye on it. So I'm like wondering next time I go to the bathroom if it's gonna be more or none or not be any more today again. But I'm like if that if it does it every morning, I don't know. But we'll see. So we'll see if I do, if it's any more today or anything. Yeah, more stuff. I don't know. I've never had that before. Usually with with Kinsley and Claire, any signs of anything going on like that down there, it was like they came within that week, you know. So I'm like, oh gosh, don't even. Like if it's this week and I have my shower, hopefully I'll make it till after that. But then, we have two weeks to our pictures, so, and I don't have bags packed or anything. We just now got her room more ready, and so, ha, ah, it's a little nerve wracking because I'm like, oh my gosh, this is crazy. So, I don't know, we'll keep an eye on it, but I don't know if, I do feel like I'm bigger and I feel like I'm further. I do really feel like she's gonna be coming sooner than later, but I didn't think it would be this soon. I didn't think I would have this going on right now. So hopefully it'll just stop and go away and everything will be okay for a few more weeks because I'd like her to stay in a few more weeks at least till like 37 weeks would be like perfect, like three more weeks. But, and because I've got a lot of appointments coming up for August, everybody trying to get in before I was supposed to be out for September. But Camera, you're gonna come whenever you're supposed to come and that's when you're gonna be here, so. However it's supposed to go, that's when you're supposed to get here and also I can't really worry about it much because it's just going to happen when it's supposed to. But there's no doubt big guys, I've got a long work day today. Hopefully I can put my feet up and rest at some point since I have this going on. And But I've got two colors this morning but I need to try to do just one color. Because I usually do like two colors together like while one color is processing I'll put another color on and then while that color is processing I'll cut the first one's hair give her a haircut and then I'll cut the next one and and that keeps me busy all day but I really need to slow that down I need to try to just do a color so that when they're processing I can relax and put my feet up for a few minutes seriously need to take that more serious now that this is how this is going on so uh, I think I'm not quite as busy next week so hopefully or I'll try not to be I'll try to schedule so I have some breaks in between. And then I've got some more. We and Mom are going to go to lunch. And then I have some more this afternoon. But hopefully I can find some time to rest. And we just went to the gym last night. I might not. I still I need to go to the gym. I need to exercise. But then if this stuff is going on. Then I don't want to. I need to rest more. 
so it doesn't push stuff along quicker, you know? So I don't know, but I definitely cannot, this already happened, I definitely can't imagine her going to due date. I think it's definitely gonna be August at some point. I just feel bigger, I just feel like, I just have that mother intuition or whatever you wanna call it, so. Sorry for this long intro talking, but, and I normally probably wouldn't even really vlog today because all I'm doing is working, and then the girls are going to VBS tonight, so, anyways, they're having like a dinner thing tonight we're going to go to when I finish up, so, and tonight is the last uh, summer movies, but I'll see you guys later. I'll give you an update if anything else starts going on, but I don't know. We'll see. Guys, I just got done at work. I'm going to pick the girls up from BBS and we get to have like hot dogs tonight with them but i'm wore out i was busy all day i tried to relax some when i could but my belly is just like it hurts a little bit and i don't know if it's like enough to be like go to the hospital or whatever or like go get checked out of the doctor but like and my belly just really just feels like really tight so i don't know no, dude, I'm here now. So, to get the girl a little. So guys, I'm um, having contractions and it's, I don't know what's going on. I still feel like it's way early to be, for this to be going on, but so my mom's on her way. We're going to run to the hospital and see what's going on, but I, I told I told you guys earlier that I had, that I was like bleeding a little bit. I was keeping an eye on it and all day it was like a little bit like, sorry if this is TMI, but uh, a little bit throughout the day. So, but I was, since I got home, I haven't been hurting and if I was hurting it was just randomly and I think it was because I was just busy working that or maybe just because when I got home and I finally laid down that I really was like feeling the contractions or or maybe it just started then, I don't know, but. I think you should just go to sleep. Really hurry. I can't go to sleep. <laughs> Panic mode. Um, I really don't feel like it's time for her yet. That's why I don't know. That's why I'm worried I need to go get checked uh, out. It's just Braxton Hicks contraction. <laughs> okay, wait till we get there. Because I would not be hurting like this if it was Braxton, Hick Braxton Hicks for two okay. hours every four to eight minutes. How do you know it's been two years since you've had a kid? Braxton Hicks is like randomly. Or maybe like for 30 minutes. Last time you had a kid. But, well I didn't really have contractions like this with them. Oh, that was so, my back just hurt more with them. This is like my stomach and my stomach is like really hard. So I don't know, mom's on her way. She should be here any minute. We're gonna run up there and check. Oops. 